Okay, so in this quick tutorial, I'm going to show you how to set your Checkpoint SMB appliance, whether that's a 1200R or 1400 series appliance, into a central management deployment. The first thing we're going to do is log into our SMB appliance. We're going to select home and from the overview, we are going to select security management and we can see that the management of this particular appliance is set to local mode which means it can be locally managed through its web UI. Now we want to centrally manage this appliance from a central location back at our headquarters. So all we simply do is select the radio button or the toggle button here. We will click apply and notice when we click apply it will rebuild itself and we will see some of these icons here disappear and I'll explain in a moment why that is. So it says modifying view to central management. Now we see some of the icons on the left, left hand pane has disappeared and these are because these are traditionally icons which represent configurable items within the web UI which we now will do centrally. So let's now set up this appliance to be managed centrally. We are going to set a SIC password. Now at this point, I'm going to quickly go into my management system. I'm going to click on gateways and servers. I'm going to click on a new gateway. I prefer classic mode. And here I'm going to define a gateway object. So I'm going to call this gateway 1400. The IP address is 192.168.1.30. It is a 14.30. And we are going to just enable firewall for now. And now we're going to set the SIC on this end. We're going to initiate it and we can see that the trust is now established so I'm going to click OK. We can see that it's got the interface from the topology of this appliance and that looks all good to me. Okay, I'm going to publish this change to the main database. I can see here what's created within my session. Now, if I go back, if I go back to the to the appliance itself, we can see that it has a successful connection to the security management server. We can see that it's connected, the name of my security management server. I can also specify that I want all my logs to go to this management server. Now I could fetch the policy from this end, but what I want to do is just show you how we can push the policy from the manager in a central deployment mode. So if I go to my security policies, I have one rule here which says allow all traffic and it's effectively an any any accept. Now of course you wouldn't have something like this representing your live production network, but in the lab <laughs> it's okay. Right, we're going to push that policy. Access control policy, and we're going to click install. We will clear some of these previous ones away. Ooh. Okay, we can see that the installation has succeeded on, the, on our gateway. So let's now go to our gateway. Let's just refresh this tab. And we can indeed see that it has now applied the policy from the central manager accord and the policy package name is called standard. And this is on July the 5th, 2018 at this timestamp. Great, and that is how we set our 
locally assembly appliance to be managed centrally. Thank you.